Hi everyone and welcome back to another episode with me, the Omega Enthusiast. The topic for this video are how to protect moisture from entering a watch and how to remove moisture condensation under the crystal. These are questions I get asked frequently. Whether you own a vintage or a modern timepiece, moisture can enter your watch if you do not take good care of it. The method that I will go through works well for me. If you have a different method that works great, please do not hesitate to share it with everyone in the comment section below. Much appreciated. Moisture can enter a watch through three main openings. The crystal, case back, or through the crown into the case tube. If it is a crystal issue, you will probably need the help of a watchmaker to install a proper fitting one onto your watch. If it is a case back or crown issue, then you will need a new gasket replacement. However, moisture typically does not enter your watch unless you merge it into water or wear it on a hot, humid day. It is a sometime issue that some of us encounter. By that, I mean the watch may have old gasket that are still reasonably good shape that may not do the job on certain days. My suggestion is to buy the following two essential items. They are a watch oiler and case gasket silicon lubrication. All watch owners should consider these two items as they can protect moisture from entering your watch temporarily. Usually, moisture will enter through the crown as we use it often, affecting the quality of the gasket. Here's how you apply the silicon grease onto the watch. Each time you lubricate, the case tube can last between 1 to 6 months. So, this will possibly last a lifetime. If you can open the case back, you can also apply the grease to the case gasket. There are several lubrication brands, but my favorite is the Seiko brand, which may cost a little bit more than the other. You can find both of these items on eBay or Amazon. Now, assuming that moisture has entered your watch, you can see condensation fogging up under the crystal. What is my recommendation for a situation like this? There are two methods. One, anyone can do it, while the second may require some experience. But if you can see water floating inside the watch, immediately take it to a watch repair shop to remove the liquid. Rust can build up in less than 24 hours. Using the first method, you will need the following three items. A scoop of uncooked rice, a small container, and a desk lamp, or any light source that produces heat. 
First, place the rice into the container. Pull the crown out on the watch and rest the watch on the surface of the rice. You can also use the rice to cover a thin layer above the watch. Now, about a hand distance away, have the lamp turn on. The heat and the rice will naturally absorb the moisture from inside the watch. The recommended duration is between 20 to 30 minutes. If you are still uncertain, turn off the lamp and continue to leave the watch with the rice for as long as you wish. My second method is very similar to the first, except you will need to open up the case back and rest the watch face down over the rice with the lamp over the movement. Make sure the setup environment is clean and away from the dusty area. So there you have it. I hope this video will provide great help to everyone that owns a watch. If you enjoy my content and would like to support my work, you can always click on the link in the description box below or use that thanks feature below this video. Make sure to subscribe to this channel for more future video and hit that thumbs up button to help with the YouTube algorithm. Thank you everyone for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the following video.